the Nowhere Boys story began years ago. Come on, Oski, what are you scared of? Felix and his brother Oscar were goofing around when... <laughs> Felix blamed himself for the accident and turned to magic to fix it. He found Alice's Book of Shadows and with a bit of research learned that spells require four elementals. Jake Earth, Sam Air, Andy Water, and of course that meant Felix was fire. He rigged the groups on a trip to the forest, then switched the maps. There's a shortcut. I'm the map guy. The guys thought they were lost. It's slipping! Felix had actually led them to the most powerful place in Bremen, where the ley lines cross. How about um, some music to cheer us up? Felix used the unmaking spell to try and undo Oscar's accident. Things started getting strange. Run! They thought they were home, but nobody remembered them. Mum? And in this world, Oscar's accident never happened. How do you know my name? Who are you? Messing with magic had upset the order of the universe and unleashed a super creepy restoring demon. Phoebe gave Felix a talisman that used to belong to her sister, Alice. Oscar is the fifth element. With a spirit to bind them, the gang were able to battle the demonic forces. Ten years ago, my sister Alice disappeared. Phoebe! Alice! Order must be restored. The original unmaking spell. If we cast it again, everything will go back to the way it was. We're going this again. again! We're home! For real this time. But they weren't alone. Alice the Restoring Demon came too. Also, now they had elemental powers. Cool! Say the spell. I can do this! To stop the elementals from doing any more magic, Alice got inside Andy's head and made him do a spell that zapped him off to negative space. We need to get Andy back before anyone realises he's gone. Negative where? It's the space between all worlds in the multiverse and it's controlled by a powerful guardian, Bear, and a restoring demon. The last one was Alice. That way. Andy learnt negative space can become anything you want it to be. But until you figure out that, it's kind of scary. Without Andy, the others couldn't do magic until they found another water element. Alice blocked all attempts to rescue Andy. To be fair, she spent a lot of time alone in negative space and didn't want to go back. So she stole the gang's elemental powers for her sister, Phoebe. You won't be alone. I'm coming with you. In the end, Alice and Phoebe went to negative space to help Bear look after the multiverse. The boys got their powers back. Oh, and Andy got to come home too. Phew, everything back to normal. Until... I knew this book was going to be special. Felix found an ancient book of shadows and enlisted the guy's help to unlock it. Then they split the talisman, allowing each elemental to do magic alone. It was a bit antisocial, if you ask me. In the process, they accidentally released a chaotic force, Tegan. There's something wrong. Trapped for years, Tegan wanted revenge against her twin brother, Bear. She put the girls under a spell and gave them powers. Chaos ensued. Talk about sibling rivalry. She's stronger than anyone we've encountered. She's coming for us. In the final battle, Tegan could only be defeated with the ultimate sacrifice, their powers. Bear made amends with his twin, but negative space was left empty, without a guardian or restoring demons, and the Noah gang had given up their powers for good. It could have been the end of the story, except... Fast forward a few years, I found the talisman. Then things got hectic. I found the Lair and Felix's book, but I couldn't do magic without other elementals. I didn't exactly have a lot of, well, any friends. I found three elements, then Luke arrived at Bremen High. He was number four. So I started disappearing people, including the elementals. Where is everybody? Sending them to an empty world where a demonic force had wiped everyone out. Here, the gang met another Ben. Hi guys. An alternate version of me. This Ben's grandpa was a demon trying to destroy the multiverse. And this spell will definitely get us home. The gang found their way back to the real world, but other Ben came too. He told me I had to stop disappearing people. You disappeared them too. I know I did, but I'm a different person now. And that's not all. The demon had hitched a ride through the world's nastiest skin condition. These creepy demon bugs called the Atrodax were now causing chaos in Bremen. What Brennan. happens when they join up again? Together, they formed into a demon egg, and then I hatched the egg and let the mega demon loose on the world. Oops. Really sorry about that, but I was possessed. I'm not afraid of you. Luckily, the gang came together and defeated the mega demon, blasting its particles into negative space. They returned other Ben back to his world, which was full of people again. So it all turned out fine in the end. I'm a bit embarrassed about the whole thing, but that was last year, and now things have changed a lot. The gang is way more powerful, and Bremen's been pretty quiet. Until now. <laughs>